Hey guys, it's Ryan with Stories That Pop, and I have another unboxing video I want to share with you. Uh, in the next couple weeks, I hope to tell the story, The Three Little Pigs. Uh, so I want to show you the pops that I ordered for that. I'm still waiting on one pig to come in, and I'm going to leave that for a surprise for the actual story. But let's get to it. First, I have this box. I have a total of two boxes to open up. I'm going to slice and dicey. Ooh. I'm really looking forward to seeing these pops. Um... I would love to know, I would love to know what Funko Pops, what Funko Pops are your favorite? Now Funko Pops, they have all sorts of pops from all types of pop culture. Uh, do you have a favorite kind of Funko Pop? Uh, do you have a favorite genre of Funko Pop? I mean, they have them from sports to Lord of the Rings to Harry Potter, uh, all sorts of things. Uh, old TV shows, pretty awesome. Okay, so this one is not from a show that I necessarily like or a game that I like, uh, but I like the way the pop looked for the three little pigs. So uh, I went ahead and picked up this one for Five Night at Freddy's. It's not something I personally recommend. It's not something I play with my kids uh, or would have them play um, because the horror element to it, but the pop itself looks like a pretty good pig. Let's pop that open. Pop, pop that open. Let's take a look at them. Put the box down there. Box looks pretty good. It's very colorful. A lot more than some of the others, which is pretty cool. Uh, let's see here. Oh, he looks great. Look at that. Look at that. You better believe I'm going to use the joke somewhere in the story how he's building his home out of sticks because he's from the sticks. Look at that banjo. Looks good. It's a good looking figure. That's a good looking figure. I'm just going to set him down right here. You're not going to be able to see him for a second. And let's open up the others. Nailed it. Nailed it. it goes rolling across the table. All right, we have two here. It's going to be another one of the pigs. And then the figure that I'm using for the wolf. Let's do the pig first. We're gonna take out the pop, the bubble wrap. This is always a good time. Take this home to my kids. Okay. Now this figure, <laughs> this figure is actually Moana, but you can see it's got Pua. It's got Pua right there. Pua I'm going to use, and I'll probably use Moana in some other stories. Uh, in particular, as soon as I have all the princesses that I need, I plan on doing uh, the 12 dancing princesses using all different Disney princesses. That's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, there's the box for Moana. Uh, let's take a look at her real fast. Look at her first. Now she comes with a base. If you buy Funko Pops, make sure that you double check that, uh, <laughs> that they, they have a base or not. You don't want to risk throwing away the base. Trust me, I've done that on accident before. Um, so I'll show you her. Let me take that base out. And I will put the base into her feet. Boom. She goes right there. It's a good looking figure. Actually, the, her hair looks good. I'm looking forward to using her in some stories. What kind of Polynesian folktales do you know that I could maybe use her for too? And here's Pua. He'll be one of my pigs. You can see the two pigs next to each other. Oh, they're best friends. They're best. This is a little brother. They're best friends. Look at that. And now for the wolf. Now, I didn't actually get a wolf. You're going to have to use your imagination. I actually grabbed. I love playing this game. When I was a teenager, when it first came out on the original PlayStation, I loved playing Crash Bandicoot. There you go. He's going to be my wolf. He's going to be my wolf. Missing that big old bushy wolf tail and everything, but he looks great. That's going to be a great big bad wolf figure. Crash Bandicoot. Uh, <laughs> Bandicoots, I guess they become they can become wolves. Maybe I can come up with, uh, I don't know, the, the big bad Bandicoot or something. Uh, what do you guys think of Crash Bandicoot? Have you ever played the game before? Uh, I loved it, going around collecting, uh, I believe they were mango fruits collecting the game. Anyway, those are the pops we're going to use for the three little pigs. Show them to you again. We got Pua, 
Okay, I'm missing still one of my pigs. He is on order. He will be coming in soon, but I'm going to leave him as a surprise for all of you. You're just going to have to watch the three little pigs to find out which pig I chose. Leave a comment in the, in below. Let me know what you think of these Funko Pops. Let me know if you enjoy the unboxing videos. If so, I'll keep making more of these and, uh, and sharing my Funko Pops with you as well as letting you know what stories are going to be popping up in. Have a great day, and we'll catch you on the flip side.